Hello and welcome to Bottom Shelf Mixology from PBandAwesome.com. Sponsored today by the Cookie Wookie. Stop by your local Cookie Wookie and pick up some of your favorites like the Sarlacc Samoas. Now available in a handy BB-8 pack. Hi everybody, I'm Jeremy. Joined today for our first episode of Bottom Shelf Mixology by uh, Jack Felgar and our unpaid intern Eric. Yes, that's all he gets to say, just his name. Today we are starting off with the White Trash Screwdriver. Uh, this is the drink that started the whole thing. Um, so we're going to start with that one. And since this is an easy one, we're going to fill time with a little history of the bottom shelf. What you'll need for this drink is one gallon of Sunny Delight. I'm just going to go ahead and start pouring and make a mess all over the table. Oh yeah, don't be, don't be shy. <laughs> no need to be shy. Yes. That's the one I got puked in, right? Oh, yes, yeah. this is the bowl oh, yeah. that was puked in by his brother-in-law. Yes. Uh, not, it's not, this evening. not this evening. Thankfully but not definitely this definitely evening. happened. <laughs> and then you need 10 ounces of pop-off. Mm. Of course, I don't have anything to measure this. The best. So, we're just going to dump some. Oh, that Those looks that looks like that's, that's probably plenty. <laughs> this is going to be... Yes. <laughs> this will be so amazing. It smells mm. Ooh, fragrant. Yes. <laughs> fragrant. Like, you won't get scurvy. No. Uh, anyway, well, a little bit of history on the bottom shelf, uh, really quick. Three years ago, uh, one of uh, our co workers, uh, the unpaid intern Eric and myself, uh, decided that he wanted to start writing reviews of the really cheap, really disgusting whiskey that you find in every liquor store. Uh, in fact, Bottom Shelf Ross is here with us today. Bottom Shelf Ross here. Yes. Uh, after he did his, what, 12 reviews? I don't remember. And almost destroyed his liver. Uh, we decided to give him a little bit of a break. And one day we were sitting around talking and we decided that we were going to start doing our own drink recipes with bottom shelf ingredients. And we have, what, 102 recipes total on the site so far? 102. 102. And not all of them are drinkable. There are some rejected drinks on there. And we are not going to be drinking those throughout the uh, video series. But all of the rest of them, you better believe, we're going to at least try. Ooh. So let's get a few cups here. Uh, and we're just going to. There you go. Oh, that's beautiful. Can you pass that down? Right down. Yeah. I don't know who else is going to actually try the paper these. Towels. I'm sure. Oh, Rob Phil yeah. Ross. You want some? Oh, sure. You want some? Yes, you want there some. There we go. It's like five times the amount I'd ever drink of anything. Yes. That's before noon somewhere. All right. Something. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> and one more. Cup. One for you. For me. We don't want to forget you. Our MC. Yes. <laughs> Bottoms up. Bottoms up. Mm. Oh, it's so <laughs> smooth. <laughs> it's not <laughs> at all. <laughs> Got the well, taste. I mean, you can taste the Sunny D, yeah, like the and then the, right. and then the, the pop off yeah. uh, pops you in the jaw. I think it yeah. might be better than just plain Sunny D, though. Oh yeah, <laughs> that one was all pop off. <laughs> so good, it's mm. uh, the top shelf of the bottom. Now, can you, <laughs> can you freeze this bottom. an ice cube tray here and make some popsicles? Out oh of man, oh, no. popsicle pop off. <laughs> I don't know if it somebody, would pop off. somebody figured that out. Mm. I mean, they keep this stuff. What am I doing? Uh, liquid in Russia, so mm. I don't think we could freeze it. Here. No, I don't think it's impossible. I think it's impossible. Yeah. They make it there. I don't know. This is surprisingly drinkable for this. Wow, he really likes it. Is, it is. It is. It's not something I would go out of my way. No, to it's not terrible. <laughs> and I certainly wouldn't inflict that on anyone else. If we if we score this uh, one out of ten, ten being the highest, what would we score it? Uh, so, uh, Ten being wait, what were we ten doing? being the highest. Ten, ten being like the most drinkable. No, the most drinkable. Okay, uh, I think five. I give it five. Like I right give it middle. five or six. Right yeah. in the middle. It's give, give it a five point five. Five point five. I guess we'll go with five. Five point five out of ten. I won't argue the five point five. Yes, it's, it's not. It's not bad. It's not good either. It's, it's not good. good. <laughs> oh no! I if will. you've got some, if you've got, if you're on a budget. <laughs> If, yeah, if it's your exactly. birthday and you're all alone. If it's your birthday and you're all alone. 
<laughs> and you really like Should we tell that that's, story? That's the rest I, of the it just history. Smells, it just pop up. It just <laughs> smells like pop up. That's the rest of the history behind this drink. Um, the first birthday that I was married uh, to my wife, she was gone uh, with her evil grandmother. Oh, and uh, <laughs> yes, and I was bored, and so I decided that, well, all I have in the house is some uh, Sunny D and some whiskey. I'm gonna get drunk, and I did, and I felt like literal shit the next day. Well, <clears throat> this is the pop Cheers up. Cheers to you. Mine. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good intern. Wow. <laughs> That's a very good that's intro. That's dedication to the cause right there. Yep. Well, that's it for the white trash screwdriver. Until next time, greetings from the bottom shelf. Bottom shelf.